What's going on YouTube? It's your boy once again, Mike McFly, and you watch another video, McFly Collectibles. So uh, today's video is basically me getting a pop that I pre-ordered from GameStop, and of course it's a it's a Star Wars pop, and uh, it's basically the Mandalorian GameStop exclusive, and also a Hot Topic pop that showed up in my mailbox out of nowhere. So yeah, I, I was kind of shocked, but also excited to show you guys. So without further ado, uh. Yeah, let's check these pops out. Funko family, what's going on? So the first pop I'm gonna show you guys and basically open up is a Hot Top exclusive. And when this one came in the mail, I was told, when I pre-ordered it basically from Hot Topic, and when it came in the mail, I was just like, what is this? And I seen it was from Hot Topic, and I went through my saved emails, and I said, oh, I forgot about this pop. So basically the first pop I'm going to show you guys as I unbox it, and woo, this, this box came in minty too, all right? Put the box sorted down, and a little dusty, but ladies and gentlemen, Winnie the Pooh Diamond Exclusive. I pre-ordered this because I have a few Winnie the Pooh Pops, you know, and I thought it was pretty cool that it's a, you know, a diamond edition. Let's take a look at the box and box, ladies and gentlemen. Mint condition box. Nothing wrong on top. Factory code right here. So, yeah, guys, Um, basically, I didn't know it was coming in the mail. I, I'm st I still haven't even received a shipment order. I have the pre-order, obviously, order. So I saved that. But when I seen it come in the mail, I'm like, Hot Topic, what is this? And when I opened it up, I was like, oh, I, I once I saw the box order, I said, wait a minute. And on the box order, I was like, wow, why they never, why Hot Topic never even basically show me, like send me a shipping confirmation. But whatever, you know, I got it. It came in, no problems. But once again, the details is basically Winnie the Pooh in a Christmas outfit. So this is for the holiday release of uh, uh, the Diamond Collection. That's what I'm assuming. And I pre-ordered this back in, I believe, July or August. One of those months when they basically said that you could pre-order this. And I thought it was pretty cool. I, I like some of the Winnie the Pooh Diamond um, Collection. When you have Eeyore, the chase, that Eeyore chase is fire. I am looking for that. But prices are going up and down when it comes to that chase. But this one is a cool looking pop. I like the details. I like the little Santa Claus hat that he has on. The Christmas bag that he has in the background. And this honey coming out of the Christmas bag. I think it's pretty cool. Once again, I'm, I don't go crazy when it comes to these diamonds. Because sometimes the glitter gets on the box. You know, the window of the box. And sometimes when you touch it, it gets on. You know, when you take it out the box. Some of the glitter gets on whatever stand that you have that you take it out of the box to show it off. But it's a cool looking pop. I like the concept of it. Um, it goes well. I, I feel like when they do these uh, diamond exclusives for uh, like Winnie the Pooh, besides Igor, they should have other characters that they should do uh, diamond exclusives as well, you know. But once again, this is not a bad looking pop. I like the way it looks. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, Winnie the Pooh Hot Top Exclusive Diamond Collection. I really like the way how this pop looks. So now let's get to the second pop, which is a Mandalorian pop. And guys, when the GameStop downtown in, my, in New York City, where I live at, they hit me up and they basically was like, hey, come pick it up. I was I was excited because I said, I'm seeing people posting these up, like saying, oh, they got them in store, got them in store. And once again, here on the East Coast, it's like we're getting things a couple of days late, which sucks because we usually get things first before. But ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, the Mandalorian, GameStop exclusive, holding the blaster basically in his um, backpack, rocking off basically. This is a cool looking pop. Once again, box is... Mint condition, good job GameStop. Mint condition box, nothing wrong on top. Factory code right here on the bottom. And guys, the details on it, it's nothing too crazy about. I just think the concept is cool that he's basically with his um, jetpack, he's basically flying off. And that whole details of the jetpack, I love how Funko, when they do these Star Wars and the jetpacks, you know, you have Django Fett, you have Boba Fett, and now you have this guy in the jetpack, all three of them together. I seen someone take a picture of all three of those together and that was fire and I was gonna do the same thing and I think that concept is cool this could have been a New York Comic Con pop as well for this year if this was a New York Comic Con pop I'm telling you right now the hype on this would have been crazy just because he has the blaster remember last year's New York Comic Con pop uh, the one that I have 
I don't even, where do I, where do I have it at? Right here, there you go, this one, he's, you know, it's basically like, if you look at it, it's almost like similar in a way, except he has a, like more of a, like a, his, he has the body armor on this one, this one he does not ha doesn't really have the body armor, but still though, to me personally, this was a New York Comic Con 2020 pop, the hype would have been going crazy, like, for this one, but once again, it's a GameStop exclusive, I think it's pretty cool, I like it. Ladies and gentlemen, the Mandalorian GameStop exclusive. This is a very cool looking Mandalorian pop. Well, there you have it, Funko family. Just showed you guys two exclusive, Hot Topic exclusive Diamond Collection Winnie the Pooh and GameStop exclusive Mandalorian with the jetpack and pistol in his hand. Both pops look cool, especially that the Hot Topic Winnie the Pooh came out of nowhere. I was kind of shocked about it, but it came in mint condition. Both boxes came in mint condition, so I'm pretty happy about that. I actually have more pops to show you guys from the WhatNot auction and also more from GameStop because uh, they called me not too long ago to pick up a uh, Halo Pops, exclusive Halo Pop, and a regular common Halo Pop, and I'm still waiting on the Best Buy exclusive Halo Pops to show up. So, uh, like, I just have pops coming in. You know, I got a Entertainment Earth exclusive, uh, This Is Fine Dog, the meme. <laughs> that pop's supposed to be coming in. And the Wolverine from the Funko Shop release from last week supposed to be coming in. And today, Funko just released, a, I guess, a television series, um, a three, three pops from television series, which was Sideshow Bob, another Office pop, and uh, I think uh, Philadelphia, I forgot the name of the show, that pop. So I believe right now the obviously the office that pop was sold out. Sideshow Bob, I think, I think as far as me making this video, it's still available. But once this video goes up, it's probably gonna be sold out. But yeah, so I got the Sideshow Bob pop. I'm pretty excited to basically get that one in. It goes with my Simpsons collection. Guys, if you're new to my channel, be sure to hit the subscribe button and also hit that notification bell to get alerted on all my new content. Be sure to smash that like button down below. Thank you for taking time out your day to watch me, Mike McFly. You watch another video, McFly Collectibles. Till then, I'm out.